Hey guys, this is the Super Review Show for this, this is kind of breaking news. It came out, of, came out, I think, on January 3rd or January 2nd. Uh, Fast and the Furious director for the past three or four Fast and Furiouses, he is now going to be directing Star Trek 3, the sequel to Star Trek Into Darkness, uh, the, the continuation after Star Trek 2009 and Star Trek Into Darkness. I think it's a great move. Um, being that he has turned the Fast and Furious franchise from a kind of a weak, dead franchise to, hey, everybody's going to see it. It's making a lot of money. Great stuff. He can put butts in the seats. Getting a guy like that and transferring him over to um, Star Trek, great, great move by Paramount to secure a director that's going to be directing that. Maybe, maybe not. He, maybe. Not just Star Trek 3, maybe he'll be able to direct Star Trek 4, 5, 27, you know, whatever. Now, um, no, who knows how, long, how, much, how much longer the Star Trek franchise is going to keep running. Let's not forget Star Trek 2009 was a time tra- what I kind of like to refer to as a time tra- time travel reboot or reset. Um, he, uh, I think he's a great choice. Fast Furious was a Fast Furious six, I believe. Believe made over eight hundred, I think it seven hundred, eight hundred million worldwide, which is ve- a lot better than Fast Furious three, or uh, four, which was made only about three hundred million. And then Fast Five, six, those two movies were sorry. I take that back. He directed the last, the last two Fast Furious movies. He uh, did a great job with them, um, and yeah, I just I, I'm a Trekkie fan. I know yes. I'm wearing a Star Wars shirt, but I also am a major Star Trek fan. Um, can't wait to see the movie. Um, I think he'll be able to continue JJ's work pretty well. Um, obviously, he's doing Star Wars, but I can't wait. Um, very glad that he's. Uh, uh, I believe, yeah, Variety's confirming it. Variety's confirming that he's going to be directing Star Trek Three. Great move all around. Can't wait to see Star Trek 3 in 2016. And by the way, just a little plug for all you Trekkie fans. July 8th, 2016, I believe is the release date, is when it's, that is the 50th anniversary of Star Trek as a whole. TV shows, comic books, graphic novels, movies, obviously. Great. 50 years of Star Trek. How about that? Star, Trek, Star Wars is better. Um, you didn't hear it from me. But yeah, I'm a huge fan of both, but I gotta go with Star Wars a bit more. But yeah, that's just my little side tangent on that. But yeah, great news. Star Trek Star Trek and Darkness, I heard I I have not seen it fully. I'm halfway through on Netflix. And then I got pulled aside to do something else. But my friends have seen it and they love it, every bit of it. The visual effects are amazing for here and all that great stuff. So yes, for, but again, Fast and Furious director is good. Uh, Justin Lin is going to be directing Star Trek 3, and for the Super Review Show, hasta la vista, baby.